As you work with your customers, issues will come up for your customers that you need to address and resolve. In NetSuite, those issues are called cases, and the individuals in your company who handle cases are called support reps. Understanding how to set up and use the case management system in NetSuite can strengthen your overall relationship with your customers by streamlining your response to their needs. Before getting too far into the weeds of case management, we need to look at the case management process as a whole. New cases enter your system through one of four different ways, the user interface of NetSuite, an online customer form, email case capture, or the customer center. These cases are then filtered through your case routing system and assigned to an appropriate support rep. Let's take a look at case routing, the process through which new cases that enter your system are assigned to support reps. To set up case routing, you need case rules and case territories. First, you will need to create case rules. To create a new case rule, log in as the administrator and navigate to Setup, Support, Case Management, Case Rules, New. On this page, choose a field to base this rule on. After selecting a field, you will be taken to the Case Field Rule page where you can set the criteria for the rule. The options you have on this page will differ based on the field that you selected. After setting the criteria for your rule, save the rule. You will repeat this process for as many rules as you need. After creating your case rules, you are ready to form case territories based on those case rules. Navigate to Setup, Support, Case Management, Case Territories, New. On this page, you can name the territory, provide a description, and select the rules you want to define this territory. You can also determine if you want cases assigned to this territory to match all the rules you've selected, or whether matching just one rule is sufficient to land a case in this territory. Once you choose the rules for this territory, you can assign a support rep to it under the Support Assignment tab. When new cases, matching the rules you've selected, enter your system, they will automatically be assigned to the appropriate support rep. One way for your support reps to quickly understand the nature of the support need is by the case type. There are three case types that NetSuite provides automatically, concern, problem, and question. When a customer fills out a case form, they will select one of these case types. You may find that you need different case types than the three that NetSuite provides. To create a new case type, navigate to Setup, Support, Case Types, New. You can name the new case type, determine where it appears in the lineup of the case type drop-down list, and provide a brief description. Once you save the new case type, it will appear as an option on case records. How do new cases enter your system? Case forms are the basic way for support reps to gather information on new cases. A major way that your customers will report new cases is through an online case form. You can provide a link to the form on your website or in the customer center. To create an online case form, navigate to Setup, Support, Case Management, Online Case Forms, New. You can use either the default form template or the custom HTML template as your starting point. After selecting which one of these you want, you will be taken to the online case form page where you can name the form and determine the content of the form. In a sense, there are two types of case forms. The case forms your customers use to enter new cases and the case forms your support reps use to enter new cases. To customize these forms, navigate to Customization, Forms, Entry Forms. If you want to customize the support rep's case form, select Customize next to the standard case form. And if you want to customize the customer's case form, select Customize next to the standard external case form. On either form, you can provide a unique name for the form, hide existing fields, lists, or subtabs, and add any custom fields you need. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, let us know by hitting the like button. And to learn more about how SuiteRep can help you with all of your NetSuite needs, visit us at SuiteRep.com.